Hi, I'm Emma, and welcome to the DISH POS dashboard. In this tutorial, we show you how to add translations. First, click on General. Then, go to Translations. You are now in the overview of your translation. Select a translation group through the corresponding drop-down menu. If you like, you can now filter the results by product groups. To do so, use the corresponding drop-down menu. Now your chosen translation group is displayed with the respective translations. To add a translation, use the corresponding text field of the item you want to translate. Note, items that not yet got translated will be displayed in a gray font. To add translations for further languages, click on the column's drop-down menu and select the languages you want to add. Now select the languages you want to add by setting the respective check marks. To filter for items that not yet have been translated, set the check mark to show missing translations. The missing translations will now be displayed in red. To go back to the regular view of the translations, simply deselect the check mark for showing missing translations. You can not only add translations for product related terms, you also are able to add translations for your sales channels. Do so by opening the translation group's drop down menu. Since those are usually not only single words, they will be edited in an extra window. To do so, select the corresponding translation field. A new window will appear. Now enter the translation into the text field. Once you entered your translation, click on Save to apply the changes. That's it! You completed the tutorial and now know how to add translations.